Hi, I'm Rip Wilson. Get to the point news. Ricegum has posted his response to Jake Paul. In his video, Logan Paul's brother roasted me. Rice's biggest point was Jake Paul has gone from about 7 million views a month to about 2 million of views a month. And that Jake simply needed drama to get back to the type of views that he was getting before. Another one of Ricegum's points was Jake Paul once said that people shouldn't be beefing over the internet. Yet, Jake Paul did start a beef with his own brother and then went on to accuse it of being fake. A saw and it banged. And then randomly, a couple days later, Logan and Jake no longer hate each other. They just magically love each other. Just now they're one big happy family. Basically, whether the drama was real or fake, you were involved in drama that you started. To answer the accusation of body shaming, Ricegum provided a old Vine video of Jake Paul, where Jake Paul appears to be making fat jokes with somebody who appears to be a minor. No, but that being said, Jake Paul has no room, no room to call me out for that. Oh, it's just one muffin, why not? I guess it's time to go work out, man. Bro, let's go to the Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. Now for me. Ricegum continues to defend himself by saying he really wasn't body shaming at all. But I wasn't fat shaming, body shaming, if anything, I was elevator shaming. So sorry to your elevator if I offended any elevators out there, if anything. Now, but nowadays the internet is very sensitive and I could see why, you know, people might see that as body shaming, as fat shaming. I was joking and I didn't mean to say that, but I am sorry for doing that. Pussy. Ricegum spent a good portion of this video apologizing, like he had done with the iDubs content cop. He apologized a lot. So sorry to your elevator if I offended any elevators out there. I was joking and I didn't mean to say that, but I am sorry for doing that. Without I accidentally said something I didn't mean, I said sorry. Jake, I am so sorry to everyone that took offense, including Jake. I'm sorry. I'm sorry deeply to you guys too. For Rice gum responding to the negativity that all he does is roast. He said this. In, in reality, that's not even true, bro. Yeah, I roast people, but there's Q and A's, there's challenges, there's vlogs, there's contests you never played out on. You might be asking yourself, who won the clash of two child bullies going head to head? Well, Ricegum has regained all his subs since Jake's last video on him, while at the time of this recording, Jake has just started to lose subscribers. That's all we have today for Get to the Point News. I will be taking a short leave of absence. I'm going to be doing some, I don't know, a, a, a reporter type type undercover type stuff um i will be leaving get to the point in the hands of my colleagues daniel scream and of course johnny blitzer thank you so much for being a part of get to the point news and i'll see you soon